Okay, guys. I feel like every year I'm doing some sort of public service announcement. I just really believe that everything should be on the up and up. Be honest, be a good person, and I really care about the community that I'm in, which is the Madden community. So today what I want to talk about is I want to talk about taking a stand against people that are burning. I'm not going to mention who's burning. No names will be said in this video. What I am going to talk about is all of the top guys, whether it's tip sites like myself or top streamers, etc., etc. What we need to do is we need to take a stand against these people and let them know that what they're doing is not allowed. If I'm friends with somebody, okay, I'm cool with them, I joke around with them, etc., etc., and I find out that they're scamming, they're welching, they're burning, whether it's money games, whether it's coin games and mutt, whatever it is, if I find out that they're doing people wrong in the community, even if I don't like the person that they did wrong, that doesn't matter. A stand needs to be made and I cut off all ties with that person. I don't believe in it. That's not the type of thing you should do. Just because it's online and it's not in person doesn't mean that these people need to get away with it. I see people that are known scammers, that are known welchers, sitting in streams of respected people, whoever it may be. It could be 10 different streams. And they're sitting in there talking and getting along with these people. And they're welchers. They're scammers. And it's got to stop. If we as a community want everybody to get better, we need to take the stand. We need to say enough is enough. Just because I'm cool with you, just because you're my boy, it doesn't mean that I'm going to back you. doesn't mean that I'm going to talk to you. If someone is out with your girl and makes out with her or something like that and he's your boy, I mean, are you going to forgive him? No. If he robs a bank or whatever, or if he steals something from one of your other buddy's places. You're out, you know, having some drinks or whatever. And then you and your buddy go to another buddy's place. And then he's like, oh man, check this out. I stole this. I mean, are you going to be cool with that guy? No, you're not. Online needs to be treated the same as in person, real life. You want to be treated the same way that you are in real life. And you should treat people online the same way as you do in real life. So... For the top streamers, the top websites out there, I'm not going to name any welchers or any scammers or anything like that, but us at thegamerslab.com, Problem Right and the Problem Movement, Madden Turf, Madden Coaches, Madden XO, Madden Daily, so on and so forth. The big streamers out there, whether it's Dubby, whether it's Joel, whether it's, I mean, it does not matter whoever streaming, ESPN. We need to make a stand and not be sitting in these streams all cool with people that we know are scammers. Having them as mods in our streams and basically saying, ah, it's cool, man. You know, hey, the guys at the Gamer Lab are cool with so-and-so even though we scam. So I guess, you know, he's cool and I'm going to get along with him. Those days have got to stop. We've got to unmod these people. We've got to break all ties with these people. They're the reasons that our community is what it is. Our community is great, but it's got problems. And if someone is scamming and they're doing it and they continue to stay boys with you and they continue to be able to hang out with you and talk with you and get in chat parties and play games with you, that is sending the wrong message. And all that's going to do is it's going to encourage other people who see that and feel like, hmm, okay, so I know this guy scammed so-and-so. I know this guy didn't pay his bet against so-and-so, but he's still cool with the top guys in the community. So, hey, I'm going to do it because I can get away with it. If they're getting away with it, then who's to say that I can't? A stand needs to be made for us, the people that run the community now. No one's bigger than necessarily anybody else, but for the guys that get the views get the followers on Twitter, whatever that is, we need to make a stand against the scammers and the welchers. It all starts with you. If you have a stream that gets viewers, if you have a Twitter that has followers and you know people are welching 
and you know they've done it, cut ties with that person. If you care about the community, if you compare about, sorry, if you care about being a good person and advancement for Madden, especially with $1 million on the line and that direction that everything is headed, if you care about it, you will take this stand and you will no longer put up with your boy scamming other people. Make it happen and let's do it. I'll see you guys again soon.